hey guys welcome back to the channel hope you guys are doing well in today's video we are going to be looking at another revolutions my voice is cracking left right and center in today's video but it is what it is we are going to be looking at another revolutions today it is going to be the unleashing potential evolutions we are going to be talking about what players are the best players you can use what are the criteria what upgrades you get is it worth it is it not worth it how will the player be of any use after doing that particular uh evolution or not so let us get into this video so first things first what you have to do is come to the evolution column uh in club you go to club you will find evolutions head over to evolutions and come to available evolutions you don't have to do what i did you just have to click on uh, sort and it will be sorted out for you so the thing that we're going to be looking at today is this unleashing potential uh why is this important for some of us to do i will let you guys know but for the main and only requirement to complete this evolution is you need to have an 88 overall player doesn't matter if he was like this player who was andre he was an 86 rated now he is an 88 he is also eligible an 88 rated player of the month or an evolution that you uh, somehow got from a very low rated like i am going to be using el sharave in this evolution to show you guys and for me also it will be an upgrade so evolution for Ev uh, el sharave has been really insane he was at 78 rated i brought him to 83 and then from 83 to 88 now from 88 i'll be taking him to 89 yes if you complete this evolution you will be getting plus 1 overall you will be getting in level 1 you will be getting plus 1 shooting passing and dribbling so to complete level 1 and to get these upgrades you need to play two rivals or two challenge uh, champions matches so and you have to win one squad battle so two rivals or champions and you have to win one squad battle with this player in your squad and level 2 you get plus 1 pace plus 1 passing and plus 1 in dribbling which actually is not bad you know looking at el sharave's card if you look at after level 2 upgrade you'll be getting 93 pace which is really good passing he's a left wing so we'll look at short pass long pass and curve and crossing which is not that bad actually and dribbling is improving really really good for this player so i am happy with that stamina is still a little bit low i don't really have to worry about that much because i have spare left wings in my substitute and level 3 so you have to do a level 1 level 2 and level 3 to get this evolution completed uh, in today's video we are not going to be playing any games so this is going to be a short and sweet uh, evolution review for you guys as well so three evolution levels 1 2 3 level 1 play two matches of rivals or champions and win one game level 2 you have to So yeah, level two you have to play three rivals and or champions, and you have to win two squad battles. And level three you have to play three, I mean four rivals or champions. You just have to play, guys. You don't have to win rivals, so it's not going to be a very hard evolution to complete. And you have to win three squad battles, which is easy. Also, you can play on semi-pro and win the games. And for level three upgrades, you'll be getting plus one defense, and uh, you'll be getting plus one in uh, physical. so that is actually pretty cool as well so this is how the final evolution for el sharave is going to look now i don't know how many of you guys have been following the channel for a long time i have done two different evolutions to el sharave before this one make sure you guys go check out the evolution videos you will get to know and this is the third evolution i'm applying on his card so hopefully i'll be able to get him to 90 plus in the future as well which is actually going to be really cool now with stamina he's going to be going from 76 to 77 stamina so a little bit is there improvement not that great not that uh, bad as well so i would suggest you guys complete this evolution first off mainly because it is free of cost free of cost anybody and everybody can you know get a little bit of improvement in their players so i would suggest you guys doing this and you'll be getting some uh, pace shooting and dribbling boost as well which is also really good for some of the players and finally why you should do this evolution is because i'm pretty sure a lot of you guys have just started playing the game or have been playing the game for a while and if you're a free to play player i'm pretty sure you guys have a lot of 88 rated players just like me uh, you need to you know uh, upgrade some of these players now i will show you guys some of the players that i would upgrade 
if uh, you know if i didn't have a good 88 rated player now since i have el sharave i can upgrade him i can actually upgrade chawa also she's a really really good card to you know apply this whole uh, evolution it's going to make this card look unbeatable uh, and one another evolution card you can use 88 overall is this a hero's card which is also pretty good as you can see he is in my squad he's in my main squad uh, she is also in my main squad and El Charave, of course my love he's gonna be there uh, so you guys can these three cards are some of the cards that I have as options but I am gonna be upgrading El Charave and some of the other cards as well you can upgrade uh, if you have this uh, inform Matthias Kuna card 87 rated card is really good as well uh, I don't think Giago Jota you need to do it because I don't know you may I feel like many of you guys will have a better version of this card anyway inform Sergio Ramos another option Modric you can take him to 88 rated uh, Fernando Torres I don't know if you want to do this you know it's a good card just let it be like that this heroes card also you can do uh, you'll be able to get some pace and uh, dribbling into them if you guys have only 86 rated players uh, if you feel like your 87 and 88 rated players are good and you don't want to change them you have bellingham as an option uh, rare gold bellingham is also a good option to apply you can apply it on cruise rare gold cruise is also not bad uh, you can apply it to saka as well mosiala uh, rudiger some of these players are really good guys make sure you guys uh, don't sleep on this evolution 100 percent this evolution is recommended i think it'll take around half an hour to one hour you guys you know sit and play this evolution not a bad evolution actually uh, you can see this card that they have used 88 rated Vaucan and you can send him to 89 and look at his pace look at his pace he's going from this to this you basically get upgraded in all six attributes main attributes so i think you should definitely try uh, this evolution out it's gonna take some time but uh, yeah i think you guys can do it because you have to play a lot of games for this evolution so yeah i hope you guys will complete this i am gonna start el Sharaways and uh, i will let you guys know how the el Sharaway journey is gonna go so yeah i'm really excited for this i'm really excited to see what other evolutions i can do as well i will see you guys in another video hope you guys enjoyed this one take care stay safe stay motivated and keep smiling guys Bye bye